Who's your master? Is he here? <laughs> they flatter me. I am only a guest in their world. A world spun of wishes and hopes. Basim, you sent the message. You led us to Eivor's grave. Yes. A hopeful message, was it not? How? You've been trapped here for a millennium. Eivor put you here. Indeed. But I'm not alone in this place. Not always. I have a friend who helps me. Together, we read the calculations. After we located Eivor's probable resting place, I contacted you. Through the digital lasses that inwebs this earth like a spider's nest. In our day, all the world was connected like this. A superorganism of technology. The staff you carry, the temples you have visited, all of it speaks as one. May I show you something? I imagine you can do anything you want in this place. Not as much as you might think. I am tethered to my body in a most uncomfortable way. But you can slow this machine down. You know how it works. Yes. We'll do it together. For another catastrophe is near at hand. This node of time has an ugly way of correcting itself. Go ahead. You're a hard man to trust. You must know that. You're not obliged to trust me. But this is all I can offer. God damn it. Silence, Udur. Verdandi. Skald. Be at ease. Your day of rest has come. At peace. At last. We rest. Is that it? Is it done? Basim! Where are you? What is that? Layla. Hello. You know me? Yes. Through the calculations I read here in the Grey. Eight years ago, the odds of your arrival were 15 trillion, 55 million, 3,276 to 1. As the years passed by, those odds improved. And as of yesterday, near even. It's a pleasure to meet you at last. Who are you? And what is this? I am the reader of the calculations. All these... possible futures for you and the world outside. I have spent much of my new life reading these. Searching for a way to finish everything we started so long ago. It begins here. You slow down this machine and save the world, from which point all possible futures expand. Millions upon millions of possible roads. But in every one, another catastrophe recurs. The node collapses and the world is wiped out. The human race dwindles and fades. I must keep looking. I must find the solution for you. I must leave you with something. This node... This is right now where I slow down this machine? Yes. I start all my calculations from this point. The only thing I know for certain. That seems limiting. How do you mean? What if you went back further, to 2012 when Desmond saved the world? Desmond? 
What if he didn't save the world? What if he walked away and let the world burn? Look at those timelines. Read them instead. I see. An interesting idea. Fascinating. Billions upon billions of new timelines to explore. Exactly. These are timelines that never came to pass, but they could have. If Desmond had let the world be destroyed, maybe the humans that survived would have learned something from the disaster. And maybe in one of those timelines, they could have found a way to prevent it from happening ever again. That is brilliant. How did you come to that idea? If you spend too much time narrowing down what's possible, you may never give another thought to the improbable. Thank you for your insights, Layla. It's only the beginning. We have a lot of data to sift through. Are you staying? Until we find something useful, I will. I don't want this to happen ever again. You may not have much time, Layla. The machine is powered down, but the radiation... It will linger for decades. By my calculations, you have 73 seconds before your exposure is lethal. I'm not worried. I have the Staff of Eden. It heals and protects. No. You do not. What? How? Of course. Of course? Fuck! All right. We'll find a solution together. However long it takes. And if that means I can never leave... ...so be it. I owe this to the people I... ...I hurt. And the people I love. Yes. I know the feeling. Let's get going, huh? A few billion timelines might take a while. It will. But it will not feel like it. That is what I like about this place. that but I'm not afraid and I'm not alone we have work to do work that may take us days or years it's impossible to say but we'll finish it what I mean is don't come looking for me it's too dangerous and and too late You see, she's fine. In a manner of speaking. A manner of speaking? Jesus! We have to find her! You heard her. She doesn't want to be rescued. Bullshit. In any case, there's nothing left to save. Not after this long. Because of you! You left her there! This... This is all a bit much. I know I'm in the same situation. No, no. 
You're in a class all your own, man. We're assassins now, not hidden ones. From the Arabic, Hashishin. Ah. And do we have a mentor? Is that still the practice? We do. Name? William Miles. William Miles. I'd like to meet William Miles. Would you bring him to me? We can call him. Encrypted line. You can talk to him right now. No technology. Face to face. A meeting of minds. It's time to take the fight to these... these Templars, as you call them. I won't go anywhere, my friends. Your animus is in good hands. How much do you know? My dear, we invented such things long, long before you did. I'll figure it out. It's a nice place to die, Eivor. Not everyone gets to choose. You bested me. I don't know how, but you did. Yet, I'm the one left standing. And now, I can take from you anything I want. Your memories, your skills, your secrets. They're all mine. And when I have them, I will put them to good use to find my children and bring my family back together.